Welcome back everyone. In my previous game I played against International Master Giant Nick and uh, it was quite an interesting game. Maybe a miniature because uh, I managed to finish the game in less than 20 moves and uh, I strongly urge you to watch this game if you haven't already. It was the Benko Gambit and I demonstrated one of my, uh, my main solution against it and he played uh, one of the important sidelines and uh, I think I managed to, to prove why this sideline wasn't uh, very popular in quite a convincing way uh, Usually I talk at the beginning of the videos while we wait for uh, a 3 minute game so uh, I just mentioned that uh, if we cross 2400, right now we are 2392, then uh, I will uh, take a break from the 3 plus 0 uh, pool and move on to the 5 plus 0 and uh, then try to achieve uh, the next milestone over there. I am setting uh, higher goals each time to reach a certain rating and when I reach it then I can uh, shift to another time control so this way I can conquer different areas of the game so at the moment uh, it takes quite a while to get an opponent I'm guessing it's because uh, today is the final round of the US Championship and um, People are uh, probably watching it instead of playing Blades online. Game started. It's just, uh, I believe Carvana is still playing. And uh, it's one of the... They're just about to finish the game. Okay, as usual, I'll play very fast in the opening and try to top this to put pressure on my opponent. Not sure what to play. Let's try a four. Really fun. This we check. check. Let's take this pawn. Not my bishop before or knight before. No knight before makes a lot of sense. If I can trade these light squares, light square bishop, it will be in my favor. A little bit behind on the clock, so I should probably maintain uh, my habit of talking less Check. 
Which year is that? It's almost dropped. That's a really good check. check. But thankfully I have knight b2 check. Knight f4 double check also looks very strong. I actually like it a lot. Hmm. Seems like a very strong move. But, ah, but g2 is not hanging. Knight f2 could. I like this. Nevertheless, knight c1, knight b3 makes sense. So many options. Okay, that's, I feel like I should be winning here. Yeah. I'm not sure exactly how. Let's try. I can take on g2 actually. I can take queen d3 check. Knight d3 looks interesting, but I would like to allow the exchange of queens. So I'll just take here. Oh, but taking on b7 is very annoying. Okay, but I'm not sure if he has time for it, because knight e3 comes with check. Check. Can give a check, check. here, and play with the 8. I don't see how he can continue the attack. Mm -hmm. Knight takes b4, or knight b4. Just finished. Check. The game on the spot as the queen is hanging behind. White resigns. This was again uh, quite a powerful game. I'm not sure if I played accurately in the opening. I think this 97, 96 idea wasn't the best. I think I'm, I'm mixing it with another line, but I'm not sure which. Hmm. I remember there was some idea in the main line. Yeah, 97 is definitely the move. But usually white plays a3, so I guess I should have played bishop d7 and, and be more flexible and maybe then queen a5 and bishop b5. Normally speaking, white is playing the move a3, and then I play bishop d7, and I get a good position. Uh, maybe we'll get a chance to see it in future games. And uh, just checking quickly with the computer if there were any significant blunders. Okay, so far Check. consistent. Yeah, overall, Check. the quality of the play was quite high. Check. Yeah, and King E2 was a blunder. He should have gone to F1, and then I should have I should be able to find Queen B3 to avoid getting my knight into trouble. King E2 was a blunder. Check. Check. I think oh, Knight takes D4 was strong, and if. Uh, he takes probably rook c8, should be winning. Yeah, knight d3 check, and just winning. I missed knight d4, which would have ended the game immediately. Check. And, check. But still, my position was uh, very overwhelming. I'm still uh, minus 5 instead of minus 8. So, overall, it was quite a successful game. I'm, I'm pleased with my play. And uh, I'm very close to cross 2400, like I said to myself. We have one more game to go, so I'd like to thank you all for watching, and uh, if you want to learn some more, keep watching the next videos.